ちょっといいかおおいやそう Hello, and welcome back to this playthrough of Warriors All-Stars. I am Scutlist, and what you just saw right there was the results of clearing the redundant Rio Hero recruitment battle, a recruitment battle we already saw back in the Tamaki route. And clearing it has led to both a new Keystone battle, and a new Hero recruitment battle. I was looking at the battle rumor, so I knew about the new hero recruitment battle is going to show up, but I wasn't expecting a new keystone battle, otherworldly idols. But, but, but anyway, before we get to that, let's do our new hero recruitment battle as we collect William Adams. Let's get started. Okay, it seems the plot wants us to accept that William has actually been with, with us for a while now. Anyway, battlefield info. We have ourselves and basically a, a nice selection of allies. Our defeat conditions are if set sooner or the allied main camp falls. That shouldn't be a prop. Now, hold on. Our main camp is right there on the top. It's right there on the top in, in past a... Oh, I get it, because we're we're heading out to help a base under attack, that makes sense. For our enemies, it's basically the Tamaki forces and some generics. Alright, let's get started. Alright, it's a hero recruitment battle, so I'm not really expecting anything too impressive in terms of, of t difficulty, but still, as always, for shorter business is building up a bit of brave. Perhaps we can capture a base before we head to that exclamation mark. Alright then, next order of business, I think that exclamation mark was Zhao Yun. Yes, and he does have more brave than us, but it shouldn't be a problem. And he's dodging the Musa with his support ability. Be nice if I could cancel out of some of Konsumi's longer attacks, but nah. Alright, let's capture the base with the flag on it before we go anywhere else. This one's talented. That's for sure. 
Let's see if this Musou can hit. Yes, mission accomplished. You know, on a side note, I'm not sure if I've ever mentioned this before, but when you clear submissions like that, you will always gain some brave. Not always enough brave to go up a brave level, but you do get some brave every time you complete a submission. So if you're working on building up your brave a bit, put priority on what submissions the game throws at you. And I can barely attack, because there are too many projectiles flying around. Oh, sorcery is captain down, so... hold on. Okay, it was musketmen rather than archers. This is still pretty much the same gameplay style, though. You know, the funny thing is, William Adams probably has more character development in this crossover game than he does in his own game. He's not exactly the most developed character in Neo. And he's dodging it with his support ability. And since it's Lubu, support ability, we really need a way to get out of it. I may find Lagrina's moveset as a playable character intolerable, but her support ability is pretty good. Right then, that small exclamation mark should be Oka, I believe I saw it say. And Shiki's forces are here now. Uh, you know, our objective is to save our, the allied man camp, but all things considered, it doesn't look like anyone's really attacking it, so I don't think there's even really th any big rush. So many enemies outside, but killing them will be pointless if the castle falls. Leave these to me and help our comrades inside the castle. I can handle this. Oh well. I guess I want them to live. Sorsha! And William Adams' l l little hero scene, uh, hold on. Before, since no one really seems to be aggressively attacking our main camp, I'm going to take the time and genocide the enemy polite player character enemy officers off the map. And that's all it took to take care of Joe Song. Alright, so what enemy officer will be in here? Tamaki, maybe? Yes, uh... Actually, I just saw on the map, and it player character enemy officer did just wander into our main camp. 
So it may be time to speed things up a little. Did she not take any damage at all? Yeah, she may have done her support ability without me noticing. Oh, she clearly has her support ability in effect, because I can see she's healing. Alright, and now for the enemy in the main camp, it is Sophie. And I'm just now noticing my health. Let's heal. Healed me and one-shot Sophie. I am constantly reminded as to why Yuanji is my favorite support in the game. Whoa! Okay, no time to take a base. We need to get moving. He's being attacked by a fair amount of enemies, so let's rush here. See, I think that takes care of all the enemies that were attacking him. While the rush is still going on, let's go pick a fight with this player character enemy officer. Alright then, with Setsuna safe, did he give his little thank you quote and, re and regain his health? Well, his health bar looks fine now, so I guess it's all good. So then, defeat Tamaki and Shiki, that big exclamation mark is probably Shiki. I'm going to assume defeats him and the battle is over. <laughs> And he dodged it with his support ability. Whoa! Heh, <laughs> Hajim knew exactly when to attack. Not that it did them any good. So, that's the William Adams hero recruitment battle, and I think that's the last available hero recruitment battle for the Setsuna route. Okay, that's the William William Hero recruitment battle taken care of, and no new battles shown up, so next time we can take a look at one of these three Keystone battles, Benevolent Princess, Judgment Time, and Otherworldly Idols. Between the three of them... Eh, why not do other uh, uh, Otherworldly Idols? I get the sneaking suspicion that this is a battle that's going to be leading to a new character ending, so... Yeah, next time we will be doing Otherworldly Idols, so until then, I hope you enjoyed this, and I'll see you next time.